Hello friends. Imagine a place where you only have orders to follow, 7-day work weeks, and no rights, or access to information. You don't even know what year it is. Every action carries the risk of jail. Sadly, these dark ages-like conditions still exist in 2023. Welcome to North Korea. Are you ready for another exciting video from Factology? Let's start. Top 23 North Korea facts that are hard to believe. Number 1. The calendar. People in North Korea don't even know what year it is. Check your calendar. Does it say 2023? In North Korea, they use the Jush calendar and the year is 112, based on the birth of Kim Illinois Sung, not Jesus. Number 2. The punishment of three generations. If you commit an offense against the country, you and your family for three generations will be sent to a camp prison. This is referred to as the three generations of punishment rule, and those sentenced may face lifetime jail even the children's, without having committed a crime themselves. Number 3. The USS Pueblo. The North Korean forces captured the USS Pueblo in 1968 and the crew was held captive for 11 months. One crew member died during captivity. The remaining crew members were released after signing a confession of espionage. The incident escalated tensions between the US and North Korea and the ship remains in North Korean possession, displayed as a museum in Pyongyang. Number 4. The transport. In North Korea, only military and government officials are allowed to own cars, and the ownership of private vehicles is strictly regulated and limited. This is due to the government's efforts to maintain strict control over resources and individual freedoms. The majority of the population relies on public transportation or bicycles for transportation. Number 5. The Bloodline. Kim Jong-un's uncle, Jang Songthik, was reportedly trying to connect two countries, according to Rodman, the most high-profile American known to have met Kim, who told the Associated Press. People say so many negative things about North Korea, and I want people in the world to see it's not that bad, he said. However, Jang Songthik was later arrested and executed for treachery. According to unverified reports, Jang Songthik and five of his aides were stripped naked, thrown into a giant cage, and devoured by 120 Manchurian hunting dogs that had been starved for three days. Kim Jong-un is said to have conducted the hour-long spectacle himself in front of an audience of 300 North Korean officials. Then killed the rest of his bloodline. Number 6. The TV Channels. Do you watch Discovery, National Geographic, movies, or music channels? North Korea has only four TV channels, the North Korea Central TV Channel for Important Political News, the Mansadi News Channel for Sports, and the Cable Line Channel for Live Broadcasts. Number 7. The Haircuts Rule. In North Korea, there is a strict rule about haircuts. The government regulates both the length and style for men and women. Citizens are only allowed to choose from a limited number of approved haircuts, 10 for men and 18 for women. The most important rule is that your hair cannot be longer than Kim Jong-un's wife. Number 8. The Picture of Kim Jong-un. All buildings in North Korea are painted gray on the outside and most have a picture of the supreme leader. Inside every house, in the living room must have a picture of Kim Jong-un. In case of fire, the first thing you must take out of the house is the picture of Kim Jong-un. Number 9. The Religion. For people in North Korea, the only deity allowed is the supreme leader. If they are caught reading the Bible, they face the penalty of death. Recently, North Korea publicly executed 80 people, some of whom were charged with reading the Bible. Number 10. Taking Pictures. It is illegal to take pictures of poor people in North Korea. The North Korean government restricts the media and tightly controls the information shared with the outside world. As a result, images that could reflect poorly on the country or its leaders are often prohibited. Number 11. The radio. In North Korea, every home and business has a radio tuned to a government-controlled frequency that can't be turned off but can only be turned down. 
the North Korean government tightly controls information and access to news, and the radios are one way they can ensure citizens are only receiving approved messages and propaganda. Number 12. Wearing jeans rule. If you can afford jeans, you are allowed to wear them. However, they must be black, as blue jeans are banned in North Korea due to their association with Western imperialism. Visitors who are tourists will not be reprimanded, but they must change their attire when visiting the memorials of Kim Il-sung and Kim Jong-il. Number 13. The Elections. North Korea holds elections every five years with only one candidate on the ballot. The vote is conducted in secret, but the voter has the option to reject the sole candidate by striking their name, though this must be done in a separate booth without any privacy. Voting is mandatory and the participation rate is typically 100%. Number 14. The Pleasure Squad. North Korea is reported to have a group of attractive women known as the Pleasure Squad who are allegedly enlisted to provide entertainment and serve the country's leaders. Number 15. The Electricity. North Korea faces significant electricity shortages, and many areas of the country do experience frequent blackouts. And it's almost completely dark at night. Number 16. The Prison Camps. The North Korean prison camps, also referred to as concentration camps, have existed for 12 times longer than the Nazi concentration camps and are notorious for their intense and inhumane conditions. Despite this, only one person has escaped from one of these camps over all these years. He documented his experience in the book, Escape from Camp 14. Number 17. The Propaganda. North Korea uses loudspeakers to broadcast propaganda on roads in the country. The loudspeakers are used to spread government messages and play music and news broadcasts at random times of the day. In North Korean schools, children are taught about the world's greatest leaders, namely Kim Jong-il and Kim Jong-un. Number 18. Electronic Devices. In North Korea the use of personal electronic devices such as cell phones, computers, and tablets is highly restricted. Only a small number of people in high-ranking positions are allowed to own and use smartphones, and they are limited to making only national calls. Visitors to the country are typically required to surrender their cell phones at the airport, and they are returned upon their departure. The strict regulations on electronic devices are part of the North Korean government's efforts to control the flow of information and prevent access to outside influences. Number 19. The Tourist Guide. When visiting North Korea as a tourist, your movements are highly restricted. You are not free to go wherever you want and must be accompanied by a government-appointed guide at all times. Your itinerary is tightly controlled, and you are only shown what the government wants you to see. Interaction with unauthorized individuals is not allowed. Number 20. The Choco Pies. In 2014, Kim Jong-un banned Choco Pies because they were too popular and he feared they would incite an uprising. South Korean activists responded by launching 50 balloons filled with the snack into North Korea. Number 21. Work never stops. The official work week in North Korea is six days, but citizens are expected to work voluntarily on the seventh day. If they fail to show up, they may face consequences from their co-workers. This leads to many people working seven days a week. Number 22. The world's only tax-free country. No one in North Korea pays taxes, but before you get jealous, let me tell you that the average monthly income is around $80. The country has a state-controlled planned economy and a low standard of living for its citizens. Number 23. Traveling outside the border. North Korea is one of the most closed and controlled countries in the world and its citizens generally have limited freedom of movement. However, there are some limited exceptions, such as for work or study purposes, with approval from the government. Hashtag bonus. Informational darkness. Why don't all of them escape this terror? Well, most North Koreans don't know anything about the rest of the world as they have limited access to the internet, radio, newspapers, and books that explain their rights and how the rest of the world lives. They are kept in informational darkness. So, if you don't want to stay in the dark, subscribe to my channel for more videos.